Welcome Capricorn to your tarot love reading. For those of you that are new to the channel, I'd like to welcome you guys. And for those of you returning, welcome back. And of course, thanks guys for all of your continuous support here. So as always, the reading here is going to be a general tarot spread. And um, in that case, guys, please just take the bits that resonate with you and discard the rest. Or perhaps you may be interested in a personal tarot reading with me. If so, please feel free to inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here in the show more in the show more section along with all the different types of readings that I offer and you'll find that a personal tarot spread will resonate with you more closely. So the reading that I'm doing here is intended for Capricorn Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising and of course for those of you that are cross-watching as well. So let's go ahead and take a look at the messages that are coming in for you here Capricorn. Okay, what is it that you might need to know regarding your connection here? Okay, just regarding matters of love and romance. You've got the High Priestess, the Emperor here, the Moon card, the Magician, the Star. Wow, you've got all Major Arcana cards so far. And the Seven of Cups. Okay, but in reverse. Um, the stars in reverse as well, guys. <laughs> At the bottom of the deck, you've got judgment. Um, it's interesting that you've got judgment, uh, bottom of the deck, because I feel like judge your judgment is going to have to... Not that you need to sharpen your judgment, but I feel like you might have misjudged a situation or you might have misjudged someone prematurely. I feel like... With the Moon card and the Seven of Cups, I feel like you're either receiving a lot of mixed messages or mixed signals, or someone is giving you a lot of mixed emotions, okay? With the High Priestess, I feel like you're dealing with someone who is shrouded in um, a little bit of mystery, okay? And I feel like at first when you've met this person, maybe, you know, the mysterious allure, the mysterious appeal was something very attractive and enticing to you. But then I feel like... This person started showing their true colors, or this person started showing more and more of themselves. And I feel like for quite some time, this is someone who might have been masquerading here with the moon card. You know, they were masquerading or pretending to be someone that they're not. So I feel like recently, maybe like a bit of an, I guess an unattractive side. I was going to say an ugly side, but that's such a strong word. And maybe an unattractive side came out to them, right? So all of a sudden, maybe they were putting on... With the magician, maybe they were putting on a little bit of a show. Like this is someone who was trying to impress you, trying to woo you, trying to court you. You know, they were putting on their best behavior here. And they weren't initially showing you their true colors, okay? I feel like they might have been masquerading and pretending to be someone that they're not. And I feel like what's been happening or what is going to happen or what's happening slowly now is their true colors are coming out. There's only so long that someone can pretend to be someone that they're not. You know, eventually the truth serves surfaces and always surfaces and I feel like you're feeling a little bit confused because you're like wait hold up you're not necessarily who I thought you were or this you know I might have misinterpreted the emotions here um, or misinterpreted the connection here yeah I feel like right now you're feeling a little bit confused with the emperor here I feel like this is someone who may be coming across as a little bit a little bit dominating right a little bit controlling this is someone who's got They've got like an air of authority to them and it seems like they may want to control you or they may try and want to control the nature of like the direction of this connection here. Okay, so yeah, someone is being a little bit bossy, a little bit dominating, a little bit controlling here. Um, and I'm not sure that you're liking that a great deal, Capricorn, um, if at all. Um, I feel like, you know, you were quite optimistic about this connection okay in the beginning to start with i feel like you were very optimistic you had good vibes and you know you were feeling good uh, a good energy and just a good vibe about this connection you were quite hopeful i feel like it showed a lot of poten uh, potential a lot of promise and you were quite hopeful for what the two of you had but then you started seeing this side to them okay it might have been something that they might have said or done to you as well might have been something that they said which didn't necessarily sit well with you and maybe that you know whatever it is that they said that gave you a bit of a peek into their true character into you know who they truly are they gave you a little bit of a yeah a, a hint at who they just may be okay 
And I feel like, yeah, you were feeling quite hopeful about this connection, but not so anymore. I feel like a part of you isn't necessarily certain or convinced that, you know, what the two of you have is something truly special. Because, yeah, I feel like the magician here is, you know, he's very big about, the magician is a manipulator, right? He's very big on misdirecting our attention, like showing us one reality whilst concealing another. And I feel like, yeah, this is someone who wanted to show you a certain side to them because they wanted to impress you or they wanted to engage you, they wanted to woo you or court you, you know. I feel like yeah, they were trying to win you over. So they were putting on a bit of a facade. Um, and all of a sudden you found out that, you know, this isn't someone who they say they were. And the High Priestess, she does govern mystery. So right now, I don't know that you... I don't know that you're certain where you stand with this person or I feel like you, you're right now you're not convinced you're not totally convinced on them you're not totally sure about this connection or about what's going to happen between the two of you I feel like you're taking a bite you're playing a bite e now you're taking a day by day I don't think you're holding your breath here Capricorn um yeah because I just feel like there's something to this person because the moon card is big about duality there's something about this person that and you know what else I get? Well, I'll say this first. There's something about this person that feels as though they're dualistic. So they can have a bit of a Jekyll and Hyde nature to them. Or this person can say one thing and then go ahead and do another. There's something here that contradicts their actions, their words, their behaviors. It could also be that, you know, you are now feeling conflicting energies or emotions about this person. Okay, there's some sort of contradiction. Um, that I'm getting here. I also feel like there is something about this relationship. It's almost like it's sworn to secrecy. It's almost like someone here wants to keep this relationship or this connection a secret. If this is you or if this is them, maybe they, you know, um, they don't necessarily, they're scared to go on Facebook and make a Facebook official or, or you know, they haven't told um, their friends about you. There's something here. I feel like, yeah, they're trying to conceal something. They're trying to keep this relationship under wraps, keep it hidden. Um, Seven of Cups in reverse like that. Things are slowly starting to become clear. You, you're getting, like, yeah, there's a lot of confusion, but I feel like you you might actually be getting a hint or a peek at who they really are or what this really will be about. Um, you know, on a negative note, it could indicate that you've had, um, you've had, like, illusions about this person. You've had illusions or you had hopes and you had strong, um, you know, strong feelings or... Uh, a strong um, like you felt as though this held a lot of potential and you had a lot of um, visions about this connection and then all of a sudden for it to come out in reverse um, it tells you that well they may just have been that just visions and illusions here okay um, and now it is leading to confusion. It's confu you're confused because things are starting on one on one level. Things are starting to make sense. Like you know, this person is projecting a sense of who they really are. The fact that they're control they're controlling or dom dominating behaviors coming out. That's who they really are, and they try to conceal that from you. Okay. So now that you're seeing, you know, um, the cold hard truth of reality, you're leaving confused because at first this isn't who they showed you right so who they showed you isn't who they really are here and now the true colors are coming out and you're confused you're really confused because i'm not sure you're liking this one bit here capricorn i'm not sure you're the least bit impressed here to be honest with you don't i don't know i just feel like um the Seven of Cups in a romantic reading does indicate commitment issues, okay? And the fact that this person is wanting to conceal, I mean, why would you want to keep a relationship a secret, right? There's something in it for them, right? If someone wants to hide something, it's because either what they're doing is wrong or they want, don't want someone in particular to know, right? So you need to, yeah, you need to give that some thought there. Also, I get a sense of with the Seven of Cups, I don't necessarily know what I want. I don't know what I want. Or you don't know who they really are here. Okay, Capricorn, and that is your um, reading. So as always, guys, thanks for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to the channel, by liking, commenting, perhaps even sharing. 
For those of you that are interested in a personal tarot spread, please feel free to inquire. Otherwise, guys, do take care, keep safe, and I will catch up with you all later in the week. Bye for now.